Shalom everyone, Lieutenant Colonel Jonathan from the IDF. I'm standing on Israel's northern border, Lebanon, immediately to my right. And I'm standing virtually above one of Hezbollah's cross-border attack tunnels that they dug from Lebanon into Israel, with the nearest Israeli community only hundreds of meters away. This is what the attack tunnel looks like from the outside. Nothing. Hidden. A buried terror infrastructure masked by hills and trees. But let me show you what lies below. You can see the level of effort that Hezbollah put into excavating this tunnel. This tunnel is fully equipped with electricity, with communications, with ventilation, with everything needed for a terrorist to get from Lebanon into Israel in order to perpetrate an attack against Israeli civilians. Hezbollah has been digging this and other tunnels for many years in direct violation of Resolution 1701, which clearly stipulates, by the way, that there should be no illegal weapons and that Hezbollah shouldn't even be present in southern Lebanon. Well, this tunnel clearly shows that Hezbollah is present in southern Lebanon. It is armed and dangerous. <laughs> and is trying to infiltrate into Israel in order to terrorize and kill Israeli civilians. One thing is clear. Resolution 1701 is not implemented and Hezbollah has been allowed to roam freely in southern Lebanon and to dig from civilian houses into Israel. We'll continue to defend our border, our sovereignty, and most importantly, our civilians.